Hi everyone, welcome to Tweak of the Week. And today's tweak is a very simple little thing that a lot of us want to do. And that is that when I click a button, I want it to add my product to cart and make it so I can check out. But how do we do that? So here I'm on the Divi Framework membership webpage. And at the moment, these links here, they take you through to the product page. But what I want it to do is make it so that it adds that item to the cart and you're already on the page that basically takes you through to check out. So I want it to be on this page. So I'm gonna show you how to do that today. And it's pretty easy. So the first thing we're gonna do is go over what the link is. And it's quite simple, it's just a link. And I've put this inside a gist here and you can see I've got my Divi framework URL and all I do is put question mark add to cart equals, and what does it equal? The product ID. But where do I get that from? Well, I'm gonna show you. So the first things first is I'm just gonna open up a new tab with the product page on it. And then when I'm on this page, I'm gonna click edit product. And now inside the URL, I have the ID. It's up here where it says post equals 3898. That's the ID number that I put there. You can also get it from your product listing page. So if I go to my product listings here and I go to my unlimited membership, there's 3898 right there under the ID. That's the number that I'm after. So what I'm now gonna do is go to my page and I'm gonna edit the page and edit the button that I need to have. So this membership button here, I'm gonna edit that. <clears throat> so I'm gonna open that up and instead of having that, the first thing I'm gonna do is paste in my ID number. Then I copy my gist here and paste that at the start right there. And that's my full link. So I'm gonna copy that again. Now I have two different buttons, one for desktop and one for mobile. So that's all fine there. And then click update. Now you'd probably normally preview this, but I already know it works. So then I go through to my page, viewing it on the front end. And now when I click on the link, instead of it taking me to that other page, it's automatically added it to the cart and we're ready to go through the checkout. And that's how you can add a product directly to cart with a simple link. And that's it for Tweak of the Week.